What's up, everybody? Welcome into NY Ups YouTube channel. I'm Matthew Fairburn, Buffalo Bills beat reporter for NewYorkUpstate.com and Syracuse.com, coming to you from Buffalo Bills OTAs, where they just wrapped up their sixth practice of the spring. And once again, we're talking about the quarterbacks. It starts, of course, with Josh Allen, the Bills' number seven overall pick, who is still working with the third team offense here at Buffalo Bills OTAs. Offensive coordinator Brian Dable said that's all part of the plan that they have built in for him. Today, Josh Allen had some mixed results. He was 12 for 18 by our count with a touchdown and an interception during team drills, but it's the touchdown and the interception that are they're getting people talking. The two minute drill was the focus of you know the Bills practice at the end of the day, and Josh Allen got two cracks at it with the number three offense. His first two-minute drill ended with an interception to Breon Borders. It looked like Josh Allen didn't quite recognize the coverage, ended up throwing the ball pretty much right to Breon Borders, who was able to return it for a nice gain. And that was a tough one for, for Josh Allen. It shows a lot of what he has to work on. But the positive is that he came back in the next two-minute drill and led the team down for a touchdown. And he did so with a few really impressive throws. One was to the sideline to Robert Foster deep to the sideline really nice throw and his touchdown throw same thing was willing to fit the ball into a tight window to Cam Phillips another undrafted uh, rookie wide receiver that he's playing with at the moment so for him to bounce back and get that touchdown is a is a really nice way to end his day and you know pick up some momentum here because the, the interception was was tough to watch but for the other two quarterbacks, Nathan Peterman was working with the second team offense after working with the first team offense last week. He and A.J. McCarron flipped there. Nathan Peterman had a pretty good day. He went 13 for 15 by our count, had a touchdown early in red zone drills to Brandon Riley, which was a really nice you know, fade, uh, really nice catch by, by Brandon Riley. And Nathan Peterman led the Bills' second team offense down into the red zone for a field goal, what would have been a field goal try if they were kicking field goals today. So that was a positive for him. A.J. McCarron was pretty steady today as well. He didn't lead a touchdown in the two-minute drill, but he led what probably would have been a field goal. And he had a couple nice first down throws that you know opened things up for the offense. He finished the day 15 for 19, had a nice throw to Andre Holmes, another one to Rod Streeter during the two-minute drill, and you know had another nice connection with Kelvin Benjamin, which was good to see because Kelvin Benjamin is going to be the focal point of the Bills passing attack for much of this season if he can stay healthy. So, you know, these three quarterbacks still in competition for the most part. Right now they're installing the offense, so the, the competition hasn't quite ramped up, but we'll see that more and more as we get to mini camp and training camp with these guys. As for now, uh, you know, all three are having their moments, but it's safe to say that nobody's really separated himself from the pack. Obviously tough for Josh Allen to do so while he's playing with the third team offense. Until next time, you can read a lot more on these quarterbacks at NewYorkUpstate.com. You can also check out a quick little highlight video we put together of Josh Allen throwing during individual drills today. Some interesting shots there of, you know, kind of what Josh Allen's working on, uh, you know, as he ramps up here and, and gets, you know, his feet wet in this offense. Until next time, I'm Matthew Fairburn from NewYorkUpstate.com. Thanks for checking us out.